Traditionally in shower systems, you'll have a curb around it that basically makes this like a very small tub. The newest kind of look of the last 10 years is you will have a zero entry shower. Um, there's a couple ways of executing that. In this case, the distance from the edge of the shower pan to the drain is less than three feet. You need to slope a quarter inch per foot. And in this case, we're, we're less than that. So all we had to do is drop down that three quarters of an inch. In this scenario, the reason that we actually did that, it has more to do with this, uh, this LVL beam pack. This couldn't have been another foot bigger this way because then we, we couldn't meet the minimum slope requirements. If your shower pan is going to be larger and you have a much larger shower, that is perfectly fine. You'll just have to have a engineered solution of having a much smaller floor system. So if this is a 16 inch eye joist in this case, we could have stepped down to a 14 inch eye joist and worked around with the, uh, the engineer. But again, this was our control point and this was the size that we could make it based on that.